Well, hello everybody and welcome to my channel crypto b and you my friends you are on my crypto show on my crypto journey and today we're going to talk a little bit about post chain if you don't follow me here on twitter please do so yesterday i put a post over here saying about i am putting a lot of work on my videos on the channel video guys it's a lot of work video editing creating thumbnails choosing projects with strong potential that I believe that can do very well to bring to everybody, create the script and bring the best content out for you guys. And all of this with my nine to five still rat race. At the moment, in fact, I am um, on my um, lunch break. Today I'm working from home, so I'm on my lunch break. And on my late lunch break, I'm making this video, um, which I, after I finish work, I will edit the video and then put up for you guys. So it's a lot of work, but I absolutely love it. And in order to help me to get away from this rat race, do subscribe to my channel and help me to grow my community. Because like this, potentially, one, at some point, I will be able to go full-time crypto, which is, which is the goal. So thank everybody for who is following me here on Twitter and for everybody who is um, sharing this content. A big shout out to Crypto Coffee and some other guys who are uh, sharing my content as well. Uh, share this post and comments and engage. This is very, guys, it helped me so much. Helped me so much. And KVLT DeFi, Mark, he also have a, a YouTube channel covering everything post chain, um, post chain and PLSP and Jacob ecosystem there as well. Uh, with all the the PLSP post post T Y R H uh, token algo the algorithm stable coins as well that are still on sacrifice phase, so all this good stuff that we love on the post chain. Let's go here and check uh, post chain. Let's go and go post uh, as they always bring the correct information for us here regarding prices. So PLS at the moment it's three zero one. It's still up one point fifteen. Uh, above sacrifice um, prices, but guys, everybody, everything is down today. <laughs> everything is down today. It's a bloodbath. It's a bloodbath. So let me bring this out here for day. Let me bring this out to here. But if we look at the, if we zoom out, every time that I have concerns, I sort of, I like to zoom out, right? And if we zoom, zoom out, we can see the big picture. So the all-time high for PLS coins uh, was at uh, 3.02889, as we can see over here. Let me put this thinner. And it went down, it went down 89%, 90%, 90% went down. And then... <clears throat> went up a little bit it went up a little bit right went back up a little bit and then was uh, running over here and then we had that big drop was when the news for richard hart um sec case uh was announced and then was a big very big drop and everybody was just saying it's gonna die it's gonna die but since then pls token went up 493 percent okay in 219 days and then as you guys can see over here, from 8th of March, we drop another 45% in 12 days. And the reason why is because everything is down. So as we can see over here, this is a weekly chart for Bitcoins. So let's take this out over here. In the weekly chart of, let's put a day here, for Bitcoins from the all-time high which was 13th of march into now it dropped 16 percent right 16 percent is like twelve thousand dollars so we are at 63. you guys look at here i have post there's one line over there that's where i believe bitcoin would arrive almost retrace to 52 which i think would be too much retrace but if we go here from all time high to all time low, Bitcoin is still, I don't think it will happen, but could go down to 47. Like this is crazy, okay? Like this would be a huge, massive opportunity of buying. 
right? As the halving is around here, 22, 23, 26 of April, some, somewhere over here. As Bitcoin is doing that retrace, the whole market is doing that retrace. Although we can see some uh, recovering over here in greens. And saying that, PLS post chain is not differently. We will have a retrace, maybe potentially going down even a little bit below the sacrifice phase. Let's put this another line over there. Potentially. I'm not saying it will, potentially. And if it does, I see as opportunity because potentially the bounce back could be huge. So even if it drops down here and start to go up and drop here and start to go up and drop there and start to go up and stop and go here. And at some point, guys, we are going to the moon. And this is obviously if you believe in the project okay so i think i said this here on the channel before i believe post chain gonna do very well on the peak of the market and the reason i say is because post chain is doing its first cycle its first bull run most layer ones good layer ones does extremely well on the first cycle if they survive into the following cycle and then they will be in for a long 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 run of success right the, one of the reasons that I believe this is because, first, of the community. Despite all the FUDs of the Hex, E-Hex, all these FUDs that was happening on Twitter a couple of days ago, because the community are very strong and everybody absolutely love Postchain. And builders are building. And the reason why I say this is because if we go to Dex screen, and if we go over here, I remember at some point, Postchain was flipping all those other uh, blockchains over here. And to be honest, it might do it again. So if we go to Postchain over here, guys, all of this. So for whoever said the Postchain was a ghost town, was a ghost chain, look at this. All these are tokens from projects. Um, I believe a lot of legit project, projects. Um, of course, there is a lot of scams, like anywhere else. If we go here, you believe every single project in Ethereum is, is legit? Probably not. There is some scams there too. Now, with this craziness of meme coins on Solana, do you think all the Solana projects are legit? No. A lot of those projects are scam, and a lot of those projects are pump and dump. So if we go here on each individual project, you will see that there is a lot of great projects. OK, some of those projects I have sacrificed for some of those projects I hold coins. So I can talk, for example, about PLSP, which is one of Jacob's projects. Um, as you guys can see over here, it did as soon as it launched, it launched over here. It went all the way up to seven dollar and then drop all the way down one dollar seventy six. And just now, like no long ago, nine of March was up at 17 18 dollars right and now have a, a retrace like the whole market is doing a retrace and at the moment is at nine dollar um so this project i like uh, a lot on the post chain and i think um if we go here to the website they are doing very well it's i think a uh, post spot is one of the projects on post chain bringing a lot and a lot of volume because it's a gamble fi um, narrative, right? And who doesn't like gamble? A lot of people look. So there is a UFC fight you can go and bet on. There is price calls. There is a uh, chain race. There is chain race. Uh, there is Plinko. There is Coin War. There is Jackpot. And in development, there is Roulette. And upcoming, there is Fortune Wheel, Sport, Powerball, and Video Slot Machine. These guys, I think this project is one of the projects in Postchain that will do very, will succeed, will do very, very well. And as you can see here, the charts are very, very healthy. Uh, when we have retraced like this, I believe to be very, very healthy for the ecosystem. Uh, market cap at the moment is under 10 million. So. Um, I look forward to check to see this project succeed in the future as well here. And so many other projects here, guys. Um, I heard about the Gopher, is the NFT, right, project, if I'm not wrong. 
uh, and they just bridge to Solana, which is great. I wish them uh, great, uh, great success in Solana as well. And by opening the eyes to different communities, different tribes is nice because we will bring more people over to Postchain. If you like Postchain, you should see your projects that you like Postchain, your meme coins or your DeFi project and stuff to expand to other chains. I believe that all the projects on Postchain should be somehow deployed in other chains as well, because like that, people will start to understand, oh, this is amazing. And they will look other places that are cheaper in order to use that amazing project and potentially uh, be able to and potentially start to use post chain. And like that, the more volume, the more people, the more the more eyes we have on post chain, that means the whole space will pay attention to the whole space will stop to, to look, to listen, and potentially to join. But there is plenty here, guys. And that's what I would like to show so many projects here. I've I done plenty of videos on Postchain in this channel. You guys can go there. I think that one of my videos there, I went through all the projects that were doing sacrifice phases. And you guys can check there. And as we can see here, I can see a very, very healthy blockchain full of projects, full of meme coins. As you can see here, the top project here is Ted Bear, which is a meme coin. And then his, you see uh, Axis Alive, and then you see the Gophers, and then you see Blast, um, SparkSwap uh, launch, which I think this launch yesterday was a, is a launch pad, if, if I'm not wrong. This PTGC, there's many projects that I, I don't even know because it's so many, and it's amazing to see, and it's amazing to see so many projects that I don't know. That's me. That means that the the the, the ecosystem is growing. And in the end of the day, you as a as a crypto investor or as a crypto content creator, whatever, we shouldn't be emotionally attached to to blockchains. In the end of the day, you want to make good money, uh, be able to be a good provider for your family and within DeFi, right, with decentralized finance and, and blockchain is a real DeFi blockchain. But so is some other blockchains that and that's what we want. We want as many um, DeFi blockchain out there, so people have the options to go. I like that we have many uh, different blockchains because like that make you to be better. If someone creates a project that you already do, just forces you to make that project better. That's how uh, Postchain was created, right? I believe Richard saw Ethereum getting expensive, getting slower, people not using it and said, you know, what? I will fork that. I will make it the same project, but better. That's exactly what it is. I absolutely love to see this. I believe, uh, going back here to the Go Post chart, I believe Post Chain can do very, very well on the on the peak of the of the cycle, and we're talking the next ten months, hopefully. I believe we will cut another zero. Hopefully, Post Chain might go to one cent. And if that happened, and I did say this before in my videos, and I still stick by it, I believe Post Chain will do very well. I don't know how well, but I believe potentially we can break the one cent. I think the one cent is the, the breaking zone. I think we might run up to to uh, to close to one cent. But if we manage to break that one cent, and then I believe potentially it can go to seven cents. Because if you break that one cent, people will ape in like crazy people will form in non-stop and then i believe that will push to a six seven cents per pls coins potentially i'm not saying that will happen obviously and i believe post is gonna do very well i think people are underestimating dexes uh, on this cycle uh, i know ai gonna do good and we know that um our uh, rwa is gonna do good dp narrative and in fact those are the things i would love to see on post chain so if you're a builder uh, i would love to see dp projects on post chain um like hive mapper for example uh on solana i would love to see things like that on post chain i would love to see uh um rwas on Post chain. I haven't seen projects yet. I don't know if there is, but I would love to see um, AI projects on post chain. People wanting to build on post chain on the explosive narrative for the for the uh, for the for the peak of the cycle. So I believe PostX is going to do very well as a Dex. Um, Ink token, as you guys as you guys saw here, we are half of the price. 
from what it was like 10, 10 days ago. I think it went up to $10, if I'm not wrong, on this last push. So yeah, went up to $10 exactly. So people are underestimating those those token guys. But when it starts to, 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 to explode, everybody jump in. People that's my bad mouth, Richard Hart. I believe a lot of people are in the post-chain ecosystem trading, investing, but without speaking. I just believe that there is a lot of people and that's why the ecosystem is growing. Okay, and Hex, I believe Hex uh, will do very well when, I, when and when I say Hex is on post chain. E-Hex, I have no idea, I have no opinion, I'm not, I don't hold any E-Hex, but if I did, I would be holding uh, because why not? <laughs> why not? And if the opportunity is to buy now and potentially do another 5, 10x, I am, um, I'll be happy, right? So if you are holding E-Hex, just hold it. It's, I don't, I don't know why uh, not. My only concern is, of course, the Ethereum fees. We don't want to be playing with Ethereum. I don't, there's so many projects that I would love to invest, but I can I, I will not because they are on Ethereum. For that simple reason, you don't want to pay $20, $50, $30, $100 for a swap, for a change, for NFT. You don't want to pay the in-guys fee. Right, so um, I I believe post chain gonna do very very well. So those are the tokens. Uh, I didn't open other um, projects over here, but if there is any projects on post chain that you guys believe that I should go through and cover here, although I have done already a lots of post chain projects, you guys can run here on the videos of the channel and just do a search there on post chain. You see there is a lot of projects. But in the channel, I try my oh, I do my best to cover all the projects that I believe have potential to explode in the next cycle. And I believe post-chain and potentially a lot of projects on the post-chain ecosystem also have potential to do a 100x. As you guys can see here on my videos, I do 100x videos that with a question mark but because I normally bring, I like to bring early projects. So those projects here, guys, those, for example, this one here never, um, was not having not launched yet and if they did launch they are very very early still so there's a lot of projects here that i bring um as you guys can see that have strong 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 potential here from all blockchains including of course posting here as well uh, meme coins and all of that if i believe the project is legit there is a um, doc team is uh, is it's have a, a good community and Potentially, that project could do 100x. Of course, uh, I will bring him the channel. So, thanks so much for everybody who has been following me here. At the moment, I have 2,150 followers uh, subscribed here on the channel. Thanks so much. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope I brought you any value. And if I did, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, become part of the family, and do follow me on X as well. All right? On, on X, guys, I do bring a lot of information regarding airdrops and things that are happening on the crypto space. So, I'll catch you on my next video or maybe on my next stream.